Hi, this is Andrew from the Marion Public Library with another middle grade read. So this time we're going to go with a theme about social justice and how to kind of fight for what you believe and what you want. This is Take Back the Block by Crystal D. Giles. Um, so this is about a boy, typical boy named Wes. He's in sixth grade. He plays video games, hangs up with his friends, the typical stuff, um, you know, boys do. Or grown men, depends. Um, so his parents are always trying to get him out to go to these these rallies um, because the neighborhood he lives in is uh, there's people that want to buy the neighborhood and demolish it so you know they're going to protest they're going to rallies and they want him to come along and he hates going to these things until someone makes an offer on the neighborhood he lives in so now his home that he's lived in all his life is in jeopardy so now Wes has to go from hating these kind of things to how can I stop this from happening? And the grown-ups are fighting, parents are fighting, they're arguing, nothing's getting done, and he's gonna take it in his own hands and try to save his home. All right, and I have two read-alikes with similar discussions. So, one of my favorite books, this is Carl Heisen's Hoot. Um, highly recommend this one as well. So this is about, starts off with a boy on a bus getting picked on, his face is getting shoved in the glass of the bus, and he notices a kid run along not wearing any shoes, just running as fast as he can past the bus. So it turns out that there are a rare species of owls that burrow underground and their habitat's being threatened by a pancake establishment. So it's like a chain, big chain restaurant. So now the lead character along with this mysterious boy and a couple other characters are going to fight for what they believe in and try to save this species, this endangered species from getting wiped out. And last, but not least, we have this beautiful cover art here, Aisha Saeed's Amal Unbound. Um, this is about a young girl named Amal who lives in Pakistan, and her village is threatened by the slumlord leader and his son. Um, they control everything, and there's a disagreement, and Amal ends up being their servant. So obviously this is not what she wants to do with her life, this is not her dream, so now she needs to come up with a plan not only to save herself, but to save her home and her friends and family. So just a lot of books, a lot of uh, great books about social uh, justice, about how to save family, friends, and how to live your dreams.